Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Belly Plays Dead Cells. Uh, that last episode, you know what, that was very successful. Got through the incomplete one and through the Fog Fjord, which is it's, it's definitely an achievement for me. Uh, this time we're just going to see, we're going to see where life takes us. Um, we may not go through the whole standard, the prisoner cells to the promenade to the ramparts. Um, we'll try something else. Uh, obviously still can't get through that door, so... I think some point in my life I'll figure out how to do that, but that's okay. Not, not on th this run by the looks of it. I have a suspicion it's like, you know, once I get to a certain boss or certain area, it's a shortcut or a, or is the final boss or something like that. But we'll find out. Oops, got stuck on that chain and didn't play that very well. All right. You know what? One of the coolest things about the last episode there was that. Uh, Found that firebrand and then a couple items that laid down some oil. Very cool. The uh, the approach that was like a, a a dot approach really doing tons of dot damage. You know it was cool. I thought that played out really well. I mean a little bit of a cheese made the run a little bit slower, but definitely increased the distance I was able to make it in one run. A thousand for one of these. That's worthwhile. Good good. Just keep finding stuff. Uh, I feel like going up is actually a good call here. Ooh. I feel like a bunch of guys just fell and killed themselves. And it looks like we have a knife storm up there. So let's take this. Still one of my favorites has got to be the knife storm. Wonderful weapon. Yeah, definitely. Alright, treasure chest. It's a good start. Aha! Flamethrower turret. Yeah, sure. That works. You know, it feels like the flamethrower turret doesn't quite have the same oomph as some other stuff, but, you know, nothing to sneeze at. Down here. In fact, we're just going to change the turret out for this grenade. Just my playstyle likes that one more. Nothing against the grenade or the the turret. Sorry. Yes. I do like the insta kill with the smash. Ground pound. Let's see what's going on over here. Okay. Worked out. Might as well pick up our money there to the left. Hmm. Oh, I just went like right through that guy during my attacks. Okay, you know what? Toxic sewers, that's what came up. We're gonna give it a whirl. Who am I to say which way we're supposed to go? Dead cells points with the toxic sewers that's that's where we're going okay well let's finish this I'm, I'm like I'm skeptical of, of that one for certain uh, but now we're gonna try unlocking the impaler <laughs> it's a oh it's a weapon I don't know I mean, let's put it here for a second okay uh, not gonna do it right now, but that's interesting. Replenish the little bit of health I uh, definitely neglected to keep. All right, and let's uh, make our way through the sewers. Oh. You know what? We probably want to go up this way. Yeah, we do. Night Storm 3 instead of Night Storm 1? Yes, definitely. I'd be crazy not to take that one. Okay. 
know, that, that grenade is doing some significant damage, more than I thought it would. Which is good. Oh, pleasantly surprised is a wonderful state to be in. Alright. There we go. Huh, it'd be good if I were to throw that grenade in the right direction. Okay. Let's bleed this guy. Well played, Belly. Well played. Kebab? Yes, please. Oh, and health. Alright. This run's starting to, you know, potentially shape up as well. And I have 13,000 gold already. That feels pretty good. Okay. More cells. Yeah, of course these guys. Can't go through the sewers without running into a whole bunch of scorpions. I mean, that's just life. <sighs> I mean, if I were to go f try to look for scorpions, you know, obviously the sewers would be the first place I would go look. There doesn't seem to be anywhere else more logical for them to end up. You know, wherever the alligators, you know, should be, that should be where the scorpions are as well. Good, good. Oh, boy. I think that was an oh, oh. <laughs> Anyways, as I was going to say, I think that was an oh, boy instead of an oh, boy. I just panicked too hard and wasn't able to, you know, put together a coherent sentence. No, no, get me out of the way. Okay, I'm going to skip the grenade guy. Oh. I get hit by that one instead. That's okay. Three health potions for a reason. Can't just avoid all... Well, I mean, I could avoid all the damage, but I'm not going to. Ramparts. Do I want to go to the ramparts? Yeah, no. Well, yes. Let's try it. I feel like that was a, a, a pretty quick progression into them. Hopefully I have all the gear that's going to be required for this. Eleven cells. Not bad. Pretty good progress against the Impaler. Alright. You know what? A 5 minute 45 second run? That's pretty good. I mean, this might mean that if there's a, a time door at the ramparts here that we might actually get it. Fingers crossed. I mean, not for certain, but maybe. I wonder where the ossuary goes now. I mean, if that one's saying it's a shortcut... I wonder where it goes. Maybe it would take you like straight to the black bridge if you got through it? I don't know. I mean, how else could it be a shortcut? I mean, obviously, you guys can't tell me because, you know, you're watching this after I've been playing, so I'll stop asking you questions, but uh, it's still an interesting proposition. Okay, took more damage than I'd care to admit there, but we're still alive. Ooh, that was an interesting fall. Uh, health is welcome, as you guys know. We'll take that right now. You know what? We can come back to this spot. If there is a time door, I feel like we can still get it, and therefore I should hurry on to the next section. Oh, see, okay. There was a time door, and I'm a minute late. Say, Libby. Obviously, if, if I'm missing that time door, any future time doors I'm probably already behind on, so this is no longer a potential, you know, speed run. Oh, see, that grenade didn't do a lot of damage to this guy. Maybe he was just tough. No. Not a lot of damage to these guys either. Okay, well, it might just be time to look for something to replace that grenade. Like, what's in here? Oh man. Double knife storm? Oh, <laughs> yeah. 
We'll give that a whirl for sure. I don't know why I hadn't even thought about double knife storm before. How could life get any better? Yeah, this is definitely the combo for me. Everything does bleed. <laughs> bleed! Wonderful. Oh, okay, well. I mean, I don't want to be bleeding, so... That's not exactly good, but... Uh, again, health potions for a reason. There we go, that all turned out okay. Okay. Taken care of. Oh, that's a, that's a pretty drastic angle. <laughs> nice. And a kebab. You know what? I, I think it's not just the whole, you know, the carrot's a little bit meteor looking and, you know, has a nice aesthetic. I still think that's true. You know what it is? It's I can see the carrot pretty readily, and the kebab tends to blend in a bit, especially with, you know, everything that's going on in this game. I think that's probably my biggest complaint about that change. Blending in like a bobs with the background. What's down here? Oh, damn. Of course, a shield guy. And then it's. Oh, just skip the guys on the left. I see. Okay. Except that I think that they have some of my knives, so I better take them out. Nope, that didn't work. Okay. Yes, now I have my knives back. Good. Didn't want to be running without a full set. Man, nothing can stand up to the bleed. And what is this? A lightning bolt. That's intriguing. I guess that's kind of reminiscent of the the ice bolt, I guess. What's it called? Ice bolt? Ice blast? Whatever it is. A magic feeling to it. Oh, that's not really... Oh, well. I was going to say that's not really what I wanted to do, but it turned out okay. <laughs> oh, wonderful. Yeah, that <laughs> that just that just felt good. Taking out that many guys that readily. I mean, that's not that's nothing to complain about. <laughs> okay. Bleed strat uh, is a whole lot of fun. I mean, I don't know how long how far it'll take me, but it's a good time for sure. Yeah, just like that. Oh. Okay. We can try shield guy. Uh, first, let's get some more health. Yes. I was going to say maybe we would want to heal up first, but simply having a little bit more health is a good start. You know, of all the elites, shield is definitely one of the ones I don't particularly look forward to taking on. But we gotta get more proficiency somehow. And you know what, this is how we do it. Ammo stuck, oh that's cool. Let's take some of this for sure. Okay. Ouch. 
These guys aren't doing too much against me, which is good. I mean, we may need to go back and try that elite now here in a second. I was going to say, almost took damage from this guy, and then I ended up, you know, walking right into him, but it's okay. Not everything can be mitigated. Sometimes I'm going to take hits. It's all right. You know, as much as I don't want that to be true, it's just going to be. Okay, I feel like we need to go back and fight this elite, and then come back and do this door. Maybe we'll take care of these guys first, and then we'll go do that. Alright, we've got double knife storms up, we've got the actual throwing knives, we've got the blood sword, everything is in place for us to work our way around this elite and just keep making sure that he's dotted over and over again. If he would change where he's sitting, that'd be great. Well, that's okay. 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 He's gonna want to uh, teleport soon, I know. So let's see if we can get above him. Jump down on him. Apply a bunch of damage. Ouch. Okay, he's gonna come over here. Oh, he's gonna come down here. If I'm on the chain, I think that's the best. Okay, best bet. Sitting right here. See, this is a bad situation for me. If that can be enough, come on, come on, come on. You're, oh, not enough. Okay, well, we're gonna wait a second. We want, we want those back. No, 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 no. Let's try putting him here. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> and just, oh man. Okay, well, that was that was no good. That was certainly disappointing. Oh well. Okay. Let's see if let's just let's try to get a speed run in here quick. We'll go as fast as we can. See if we can get a door or something like that. Um, if we do, that'd be badass. Okay, it's run time. Nope, this is not the way to go. All right. I mean, I'd still want to kill a few things to get some cells, but I shouldn't be diddle daddling with these guys. No, we'll skip him. Down seems like a good choice. Ah, uh, yeah. Otherwise, how am I going to find these things? Okay. Now back to speed run. Only been distracted twice. That's okay, we're only at 38 seconds. Oh, right, ice bow. Yeah, I want the kebab. Okay, where are we headed here? To the right. Don't know, I'll skip the vendor. Okay, alright. Damage I didn't need to take. There either. But we're okay. We are gonna try this item that I've never tried before. I assume it's melee. The nutcracker stuns victims that have more than 75. Okay. Oh boy. Okay. That's interesting. The heart. Uh, I probably shouldn't have skipped the heart, but that's okay. That was way more damage than I should have taken. It's okay. We'll skip past him. Alright. There you go. 
minute 51. We're at the promenade. I suspect that's probably pretty good timing. I, I don't recall what I was at. I think it was sub two minutes, kind of like this, when I had made the speed runs before. So hopefully this is all in good order. You know what I'm really interested to try here at some point, and I really hope it just shows up? Is that broadsword? Man, that thing had a move set that looked pretty cool. Yeah, I was definitely a fan of some of the bigger weapons and, and Dark Souls. I, I like that metered and tried and, and uh, what do you call it, like distinctive? No, that's not the right word, but purposeful swings. Knowing what your timing needs to be and not being able to mash anything. You know, I think that it's a cool way to go about gaming. I almost felt like you had to learn the moveset of that specific weapon more so than other games, which I guess, you know, that's probably part of the allure of that series. Okay, well that's definitely not a time door, so we're going to skip there. Now the time door is usually in the second spot. Now I'm hoping it's a blueprint that we find if it is open. Okay, that's good to know. There we go. No, no blueprint. Okay, well, fine. Lesson learned. I still don't need to get down here. Good to know. Unless there's something over here. Whoa, what is this? Oh. Cool. All right, so some cells. That's not bad. I'll definitely take that. Okay, you know what? This I mean, this nutcracker is cool, but the move set is pretty slow on it. I got I got to be careful with it for sure. <laughs> Chicken. Oh, see that does way more healing. Okay, cool. All right, now I'm not so sad that uh, I don't see more carrots because, you know, being able to have chicken and kebabs, that's good. A little bit of variation is definitely welcome. We're just going to drop down. Oh, boy. Okay, we can fight our way through this. I feel like the range on this hammer is, is farther than I kind of anticipated at first. Like, it, it looks pretty short, but then it looks like the animation actually does, ha like, has some reach to it. If I could hit that this guy, that'd be great. There we go. And it seems to have some knockback, at least on the, uh... Oh, what do you even call those, like... The dummies. There we go. Finally got that guy. And what's up here? Nothing I actually wanted. Oh, <laughs> that definitely wasn't anything I wanted either. This might be, though, the Frost Blast. Hmm. Meh. Meh. Not this time. Actually, you know what? I think I can go even farther. Yeah, there we go. Why stop there? Skip all of this. And a kebab. Nice. Okay. Wonderful. I don't know what just... It seemed like everything got lighter there for a moment. Now, I may just be imagining that, but it certainly seemed like it. Okay, here we go. We are definitely on our way to the ramparts at this point. Actually, you know what? Maybe we will try the lower path instead. Okay, that's really not going well. 
All right, healing time. The stunning with this one over 75% is good because it means you can just keep swinging. But if you happen to catch somebody after that 75%, they can still get a swing in pretty readily on you. And that, that's a little bit of a downfall on this on this weapon. But I guess, you know, it can't be that every weapon's perfect. All right. Super Mario mode. What? <laughs> Uh, okay, I don't think it's worth half my cash, but that's kind of cool. Let's do this one. We already have three health. We're going to go strength. Doing a little bit more damages. Uh, just on our normal swings would be pretty welcome here at this point. That's Super Mario mode, you know? That's cool. It's cool. I like little things like that. Got him. All right, I mean, I'm catching things I don't like about this hammer, but at the same time, I'm also, you know what, I'm enjoying it. And I'm also taking some damage. No, we got through. We got through and we're sitting at 31 souls if we can make it through the end of this level. Here we go. All right, we're gonna go this way this time. We've been to the ramparts. Plenty of times recently. Instead, we're going to go to the prison depths. Now, if I remember correctly, this is still going to kick us out onto the the black bridge. But you know that's cool. Always willing to take on the incomplete one. Let's get the harpoon going for sure. Uh, then what's next? Instead of the blood shield. Uh, no, no. We're just going to do blood shield. We'll just do it. That's definitely not the blood shield that was. Okay, well, mistake on my end. That's all right. Okay, so the Nutcracker 1 versus the Impaler 4. It's a massive amount of damage in update or upgrade. Burn targets, enemies burn when they die. Okay, let's give it a whirl. Whoa. Okay. All right. That looks cool. It definitely looks like it's a little bit more medium range like I was asking for. So this is kind of exciting. Hey man, we are getting a, a pretty intense sunset at my place here. I'm looking outside and it's like all the houses across me are opposite of the sunset and they're like blood red. It's kind of cool. A little creepy too, but also cool. I see. So I get some knockback with this. And I seem to be like somewhat stunning guys as I'm using this. Okay, well, see, I can't just stun them mid everything, apparently. All right. Obviously, I have some stuff to learn on this one, but not bad. Yep, so far, so good. What, what, what? What was I getting hit by? Oh, I think if I hit the backs of these guys, that's bad. That's bad, okay. Yeah, that's that's a bad thing to do. Most definitely a bad thing to do. <sighs> okay, let's heal again. Let's not take out those guys. Oh, I wish I understood that, that damage a little better. Because, man, I've already taken a lot of damage. I only have one healing potion left here. What? 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 Okay, well, it's, you know, aerial these guys, apparently. What? This is insane, this guy. Uh, unfair. Holy crap. Okay. That weapon is pretty impressive to, uh, man, to get me through that. Uh, 
very happy that it did that, but this right here, oh, just insane. Okay, okay. Uh, I need to get better at dodging everything ASAP. Because I really can't take much more damage here. That, or we just need to find the exit. I think I think that's really what this comes down to. Let's see if this just takes us somewhere good. Oh, well, that's not exactly what I would have considered good. Alright, I don't know why I fought that guy considering... Oh boy, two of them? Okay, we're, mo we're moving on. Okay, okay, alright, alright, alright. Oh, my heart is pounding on that one. That was pretty intense. Uh, that did not take me to anything I wanted to actually go to. So, oh, you know what? There's a heart there. We can grab this heart. Oh, man, for like all our cash. Well, that's what the money's for. Man, that's... I mean, I feel like I'm going to underutilize this pretty significantly by just dying soon, but, you know, just, you know, it's just a risk, that's all. More of these guys, good. Okay, alright. I mean, I seem to be able to take care of the flying guys oh, alright. But it's not a good time. And now I'm down in here. Okay. Okay, I'm still alive. I'm still alive. I mean, technically, I've died. But I've come back to life. So, you know, in some ways, great success. Okay, we're going to skip the guys down there. At this point, at this point, this is uh, find my way to the end. That's what this is. I want to keep my 10 cells, and I want to try the incomplete one again. Uh, uh, what is this guy? What is he? I don't know how I'm feeling about all these new guys I'm running into. Uh, we're not fighting an elite. That's not happening right now. Oh, I think they just, like, obscure my vision. Yep, definitely. That's kind of cool. That's, like, all my health right there. Okay. Damn. Well, that mist guy ended up being... <sighs> I don't know how to put it. Anyways, this was some interesting runs. We've unlocked some new weaponry. This... You know, this impaling weapon, the sphere, pretty cool. I'm pretty happy. I'm happy where we got, but we obviously didn't get back to the incomplete one. So, you know, next time maybe we will try to go the normal route again, take down the incomplete one, and see if we can get past the graveyard. I think that's a pretty good goal. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the like button. Also, hit subscribe so you can see when my next videos come out. I appreciate you hanging out with me tonight, and we'll catch you soon. Have a good one. Bye-bye.